Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you what to do if you're getting the message there was an error starting your game on Hearthstone on Windows 11. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to simply restart the Battle.net client. Now in order to do this, if you already have the client opened up, make sure to click on the show hidden icons arrow and then right click on the Battle.net client and select the exit option. Now the last thing that you have to do is simply double click on the Battle.net icon on your desktop, then wait until the client will initialize and afterwards just click on the blue play button under Hearthstone. And then you can check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to add Hearthstone as an exception in the firewall settings. Now to do this, press the Windows button, then simply type firewall and then select Windows Defender Firewall from the search results. In here, just click on allow an app or feature to Windows Defender Firewall and afterwards, the first thing you have to do in here is simply click on the change settings button. This will allow you to modify the settings in this list. Next, just scroll down until you find the Hearthstone game, click on it and make sure to tick the box next to both private and public sections. Now the last thing you have to do is simply click on the OK button and restart your computer and check if the Hearthstone game works properly. Next, another useful solution is to run the game as an administrator and in compatibility mode. Now to do this, just right click the Hearthstone icon and select the properties option. And now in the Hearthstone properties window, make sure to click on the compatibility tab. And in here, the first thing you have to do is tick the box next to run this program as an administrator. And now the last thing you have to do in this window is to tick the box next to run this program in compatibility mode for Windows 8 or Windows 7, it doesn't matter. This should work properly after you save the changes. Now just click on apply and OK and you'll see that from now on if you're trying Hearthstone it will run as an administrator. And then you can check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another great solution is to scan and repair Hearthstone via the Battle.net client. Now to do this simply click on the show hidden icons and open up the Battle.net client and then in the Hearthstone category, make sure to click on the gear icon next to the play button and select the scan and repair option. Now the last thing you have to do is click on the begin scan button and wait until the game will be scanned and if it finds any corrupted files, it will fix them automatically. Then you can just restart the client and check if the problem still persists. And as a last resort, another great option is to simply reinstall the Hearthstone game. Now to do this, press the Windows button, then select the settings icon and afterwards click on apps on the left pane and then on the right side select the installed apps category. Now in here just scroll down until you find the Hearthstone game, click on the ellipses next to it and select the uninstall option. Afterwards restart your computer, open up your Battle.net client and you'll have an option to reinstall the Hearthstone game. And you can check if the problem still persists. And that's it, super simple, isn't it? Of course, if you enjoyed this video and it helped you, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.